Greetings, YouTube! Under the medley of rock, hopefully you can hear my voice. And welcome to round number 67 of The Hunt for Stark Spidey, sponsored by MathKing18, who is the lone awesome uh, donator to the stream tonight, but it's also sponsored by an unnamed athlete because I could just find a bunch of no-name offensive linemen that were number 67. So hey, if you were number 67 in high school, as maybe like a football player, I guess this round is technically dedicated to you, YouTube viewer. Now, this is my five-star roster that you're seeing. Of course, I still need Awakenings of Ghost Rider and Corvus and Killmonger. Those are my top three non-Stark Spidey options. Of course, Ghost would be incredible. And some of you would say, Prof, forget about Stark Spidey, just rank up Ghost. But uh, you know what? We'll see what happens. It's round number 67, and I couldn't be more excited to finally get a five-star crystal opportunity. It's going to be a while before we have another one, because next month we don't have any side quest until those back issues come into the game. So, kind of unfortunate about that. So we won't be getting the daily five-star shards like the Occult Labs give us, although the Occult Labs are going to keep me up with PTSD-level nightmares. So probably not a good idea. Now since this is round 67, Mr. Math King, being in charge of the crystal, has said that 6 plus 7 is 13. So he wants to pop this crystal and he wants to do it on 13. So is that the winning formula to get Stark Spidey? Maybe. I know many of you don't want me to get Stark Spidey right now because you'd much rather wait for round number 69 and if I don't get him... I'm only one miss away after this in round 68 for round 69. So, what are we going to get? I don't know. But what we're going to do is we're going to hit this open. I think we'll wait for ghosts uh, to pick to pop up. And then we're going to count to 13 and we're going to pop it just like Math King agreed with. A lot of good new champs though. Proxima Corvus, Sabretooth, Bishop, eh, not so much. There's Ghost. Okay. We're going to count to 13. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And other puns. Um, I said I wanted a new champion, and Crossbones is a new champion. I get a lot of questions about whether or not I should rank up my Crossbones every week. It seems like Crossbones is a popular five star for many people to open when they haven't opened five stars before. You know, when I talk about Crossbones, I say he's a very solid champion, but he's never going to be in the skill class of a Blade or a Killmonger or, you know, even a Gwynpool, right? So Crossbones is certainly in the upper tier, but not someone that I would get super excited to, uh, to rank up. I I'm definitely going to save all of my materials for someone better. And certainly for those of you who are wishing that I didn't pull Stark Spidey, well, I guess you got your wish because now... We are only one miss away from round number 69, a number that so many people have spammed the comments of every video I've made for reasons. And uh, now we'll have an opportunity to get round number 69 if we don't get him in round 68. And keep in mind, round 69 might also be the new Dungeon Crystal, which comes out later this month, hopefully. So, thanks for watching YouTube. Thanks for supporting this never-ending quest of depression. Crossbones is a new champion. I can't complain about that. Certainly in more arena fodder, which I always need to build up that five-star featured arena faster. So I will uh, see you all in the next Hunt for Stark Spidey, round number 68. And until that time, have a great one, YouTube.